morning, dragons. I'm Mr. Salerno, and this is Flame, and look who's closing out the week with us. It is so great to see you, Pied Pierre. We're glad you made it on the show, and we want to welcome you to the News of Camelot. Today's Friday, May 13th, 2022, and it's the end of the week. We made it to the end of the week, Pied Pierre. This is great news before we get going on our show, dragons. Let's hear what Eliza has to say. Take it away, Eliza. Allegiance to the flag of the United States of America and to the Republic for which you stand, one nation, under God, indivisible, with justice for all. Now that's a great job, Aliza, and in front of a school bus. <laughs> That is wonderful. Thanks for doing that Pledge of Allegiance and leading us in the moment of silence. Flame, the sun is going to rise today at 5.58 in the morning, even behind the clouds. And Pirate Pierre, the sun is going to set at 8.13 in the evening, probably behind the clouds. But that will not keep us sad, dragons. There is a lot to look forward to. It's the weekend. We've got some morning meetings. Where we're going to get in a circle and we're going to talk. We're going to share about the goodness in each other what we see in each other but before we get too deep into our morning meeting we want to share that there's a very important this day in history dragons and it happened all the way back in 1607 and pirate pierre brought it to our attention we appreciate that pirate pierre that this is the exact day may 13 1607 when jamestown was founded by the english and those english that settled in virginia they created the first colony of Jamestown. That is important to the people of Virginia. So we wanted to mention that. There might be some other fun things that have happened throughout the month of May that you can bring to our attention. But make sure that you understand that this is an important day in Virginia history. Dun -dun -dun! It's time for the birthday box. And because we have so much time dedicated to morning meeting today, we want to make sure that we honor the birthdays in a very strong way. To the point and strong. Like today. We only have one birthday. We save it for someone special. And that's Coach Mac. Coach Mac. Happy birthday to you. Wonderful news in the gymnasium and outside if it's not raining. And then tomorrow. Let's do the Saturday birthdays. Tomorrow, Dragons. We have Kyle and Ciso Angelio. Kyle, happy birthday to you in second grade. And Joseph Herrera Reyes. Way to go, Joseph. Happy birthday to you also in second grade. And Dragons. It's Miss Moon's birthday. We love Miss Moon. She is highly intelligent and very effective. Way to go, Miss Moon. Happy birthday to you. Let's get to the mail. We've got some mail to check. So many letters yesterday and into today. And this says here, ooh, this has like a big package attached to it. It says, Dear Flame, my towel has a lobster on it. I love the ocean. And this person sent us the towel. It even has all the legs. Those decapods. That's a great town. There's lobsters everywhere. Oh, and all these fun creatures. Oh, it doesn't have a name on it. But nevertheless, dragons, we love lobsters and we love the ocean. And Noah, so artistic. Not an insect, not a lobster. But flame after a barbecue. Very nice. Okay, this says here, Dear Flame, you're the best. Please tell Pirate Pierre that also. Niakuto. Nice job. Oh, that is nice. Up. Oh, now I have a joke for you. Dear Flame, Scarecrows should get an award because they're outstanding in their field. Ah, that's great. That's oh, get it outstanding. Another. Oh no, no name. Well. Very legible jokester. Thank you for that wonderful joke. That is fun. Dear Flame, what is your favorite number and what is your favorite letter? Wow, that's tough. That's tough. Favorite number? Whew, we got to think hard on that one. What do you think, Flame? What's your favorite number? You have a 10? 10? 10. 10. Okay, we'll go with 10 and your favorite letter. C? Well, that's nice. Or P for Pierre? That's nice. Or C for Camelot. Okay. Very nice. Romeo, great questions. It might change every day. That's hard. 
like what number you'd put on the back of a shirt. That's probably Flame's favorite number. Or yours, yours, Pipe here. Yeah? Okay. 24. That's interesting. Okay. Dear Flame, bad news that Taste of Camelot will have to wait until next year. Wait a second. Due to the weather, there will be no Taste of Camelot tonight. Please tell your family and friends we hope to schedule this again next year from the PTA. Rain, rain. Why do you have to stay, rain? That is not cool, but no taste of Camelot. That's too bad. There better be some tasty fish and some other cultures that celebrated their tasty habits. Oh, well. Oh, well, dragons. The rain wins, but we can stay safe and we can look forward to it next year. And don't forget... It's the end of the week. It's time to celebrate each other, dragons. It's time to look each other in the eye and say, I appreciate what you do. I see the goodness in you and what I'm thankful for because that is a pillar in our positivity project. There is goodness in all of us, dragons, and having the chance to recognize it and maybe saying something like, I want to give a tasty fish to so-and-so. Or, I want to give a tasty fish to you because you mean a lot to the class and you've done a great job. So take that moment, dragons. You'll build a greater community not regret your decision. So, on behalf of Flame, on behalf of Pirate Pierre, I'm Mr. Slarno. Enjoy the end of the week, dragons. Be safe, make excellent decisions. Thanks, everyone. Bye.